Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Tribunal. And when we last left off, we were in the Dark Brotherhood's sort of... What is it? This is their main base. Um, we have killed loads of them, but apparently they come back. Not the ones that we kill, just other ones. See? They respawn. But we do have this really cool amulet. Watch. Oh crap. See that? They kill each other. Like they attack each other. And then they don't attack you because they're under your dominion. How cool is that? I have not used that. I have not used that ability ever. Maybe command um, creature. But it's it's a very powerful, very powerful, very impressive, and it's incredible. I'm surprised we haven't put that to good use before, but we haven't. Anyway, yeah, a long time ago we found a contract. Hello, what lady. This about? Black dot guy. I haven't seen any ghosts actually, but um, if I do see any ghosts, I would definitely. Keep an eye out to see if it's your husband. I believe is it your husband. I don't know. I think it's your husband. Let's just assume it is. Okay. <laughs> ah, it's all everything respawns. Great. I don't really want to fight any of you. Sorry about that, everybody. I don't want to disturb the the whole whole the whole balance of nature etc by you know unnecessarily terminating your life etc <laughs> right so maybe we should ask uh, a guard we can find a guard they stand out like a sore thumb right here's a guard excuse me uh, high Thank ordinator you to be brief Sarah yes well um dark brotherhood uh Okay, I got this contract here um, for my head. Ooh, our stronghold's completed as well. That's good. The contract was written. This should give us some clues. That who wants me dead? I should report my findings to a guard immediately. Hello, guard. Um. Ah, uh, persuasion. Persuasion. Pers uh, I shouldn't have. Persuasion. Persuade, right? That should be enough. You believe you've, uh, you believe you've killed their leader? Maybe, maybe not. Perhaps you should speak with Fedris Heller about this. Who is this? Fedris Heller is the chief steward of Al Malexia, and you may find him in the temple reception area. Right. Well, thank you, Mr. High Ordinator. I appreciate that. That's the armory. That's the bookseller, and that's the magic shop. I'm gonna go to the armory. Oh, lovely lady. Yeah, that's. Um, I think I'm gonna get your disposition up high. Or at least try to, because we're gonna be dealing an awful lot in the future. There we go. That's great. Brilliant. What's good for the empire is good for business, citizen. I'm sure it is, lovely lady. Okay. So you've got ten grand, and I've got a whole bunch of stuff that's worth a lot. So here's one, and here's one. Now ah, you're taking you're you're taking a lend of my good nature, there, my my friend. You're only giving me... I want at least 10 grand for them. Because that's worth 12 grand to you. Their best, that's, that's their base price. Oh, I'm not having to click on... Can I... No, just select. Sell a max, yes. Come on. That's three Viper Shard Blades there I've, I've given you. Ugh. <sighs> Butter again. <laughs> right, that's three. Set the max, okay. 
Come on, you surely must you surely must see what a good deal this is. She's not really budging, is she? Uh, no, she's not. Although she didn't go down too far. Alright. If I sell four to you. Right. Sell the max. Oh, you drive a hard bargain, my friend. You drive a hard bargain. Well, we got ten grand for that. Goodness sake. They were worth a lot more than that. Let's see what you've got in your house. Hmm? What you've got in your house? Nothing. Great. Right. Maybe we should go to this temple place that this guard was telling us about. Do you think that's probably a good idea? Or that guard? That's what he said. The temple. Temple reception. So that's the sewers. That's the temple courtyard. Right, that's where we should go. I hear that music. It's very eerie. Come on, let's go this way. Let's see what we can find. Let's see what we can see. Reception area. Right. Um, hold on, what's it's your name? Another perfect day in Mournhold. Your name is Granny Varys. And you are the guy I was looking for. Um, I like your great, glass pauldrons there. It looks very cool. Ah, you were the one who recently arrived here in Mournhold from Vardenfell. I was told of your arrival. I understand you had some problems with the Dark Brotherhood. An interesting group. And usually rather effective. I'm surprised you're still alive. Perhaps you have potential. Or they sent incompetence. <laughs> I believe you might be of service to Our Lady. Our Lady, who is this? I am always aware of those who might be able to serve Our Lady Almexia. Few are worthy to do so. The temple in the city is guarded by the high ordinators and the hands and the hands and the hands fulfill other duties for the lady i am her chief steward Fedris heller heller i wonder if you're the edge who sent to kill me you may be or maybe you're not because you say that you're usually rather effective but perhaps they sent him i don't know now, if you wish to be of, to be of use, we have some matters to discuss. All right, what matters? Perhaps you have already met young King Harlu Helseth, a foul man, unworthy to sit on a throne. Still, he holds the right of succession. The lady must keep an ever watchful eye on this king, though, lest he do something that would be detrimental to the temple our fair city or perhaps all of Morrowind. Currently there are concerns about the new some new recruits that Helseth seems to be training. Helseth? That could be H too. He might be trying to kill us. Alright, what new recruits? A standing army is nothing new in the city, though it is largely unnecessary. Mournhold is protected by her walls from the outside, and by Our Lady Almexia from within. None would dare uh, mount an attack here. Still, traditional tradition dictates that the king maintains an army. We believe that Helseth is raising quite a different sort of army. A goblin army? A goblin army? What? Foul, vicious creatures. No wonder Helseth has chosen them to be his foot soldiers. I know that the goblins are being trained nearby, though not where exactly. Ask around the city about goblins. Someone will know. I wish for you to find the location of the tr goblin training area. When you do, kill the war chiefs. There should be two. Sever the heads of this the head of this army and the rest will shatter like a scrib okay you might rid the city of the two ultimate trainers as well complete this task and the lady will be pleased okay ultimate trainers traditionally ultima have been used to tr you have used the goblins to reinforce their armies why 
I do not know. Rumour has it that Helseth has contracted two Altma to train the, his goblin army. If you find these Altma, it would be a service to this to rid the city of them as well. All right, what about goblins? Miserable, horrible creatures. They are vile, vicious, uh, and they vary in size from small to the like smaller than a bosma to larger than a nord. Some are mindless animals, others have learned the ways of magic. You will often find them with trained Durzogs and other filthy creatures. What is a Durzog? Frightening creatures, possibly even more intelligent than the goblin handlers. You might hear them refer, referred to as sludge puppies, but don't let that name fool you. They're strong, smart and often well-trained creatures. The goblins use them on patrols to hunt down their victims. Oh, they sound like attack dogs to me. Okay, and what about this Helseth? Our new young king, he is ruthless and not foolish, as some would have you believe. He is one of our mother's political sav... Uh, one of his m mother's political savvy. And he has all the, his father's ruthlessness... Okay. Right. Well, that's interesting. I think we have to save up for today. But when we come back, we have to ask about goblins. It'll be interesting. We've also got to investigate um, these Altma trainers. So we'll try and find out what they are. Sounds like we've got a good mission to do. And very interesting. And I wonder if the king has been sent to, sent someone to kill us. Because that's rather suspicious that his his name is Helseth and it was H marked on the contract but why would he want to kill us that's a good question anyway well that'll be for next time so anyway when we come back that will be what we'll do but until then stay safe take care of yourself and goodbye